YouTube, I'm back again, and I got another review for you, and I'm actually quite surprised, surprised about this, but I'll get to what I'm talking about in a moment. The review I'm going to be doing is this one, is this product right here. This is another product from Shea Moisture. This is the Shea Moisture Olive and Green Tea Body Wash with Avocado. It's anti-aging and it's ultra-moisturizing, and you can pretty much read the description here. I'm not going to read it, but I'll show it to you. Um... Ingredients, as usual, the ingredients here are pretty darn clean, nothing harmful, nothing you really can't pronounce, and I have to say, this was the first body wash from the Shea Moisture line that I've actually tried, and I gotta tell you, I'm actually pretty impressed. I'm pretty impressed by it. For starters, the body wash, the, the only body wash that I remember using before I even decided to switch to Shea Moisture uh, was Dove. And I used to use Dove when I was, like, in high school, and I, I only used Dove just because I liked the way it smelled. But I read the ingredients, and I didn't really like the fact that it had petroleum in it and other stuff I couldn't pronounce. So, unfortunately, I had to break ties with Dove. Now, I went to Bar Soap for a minute, and I decided to stick with Bar Soap for a while, but... After a while, when you bathe in hard water, Bar Soap tends to leave a bit of a film on your skin. So I decided to drift back to body washes, and I ended up picking this up from Target. You can find this at Target, and if you're lucky enough, you can probably find this at CVS or Walgreens, if, you, if there's a Walgreens available to you. But I prefer Target. That's where you can find this stuff. But like I said before, I am actually pretty impressed by this. It's, I don't know if you can see it. It is, it's like a gel, a bubbly gel kind of stuff here. And like I said, it has no harmful ingredients in it, and I can't speak, I can't really speak on the anti-aging thing because I'm pretty young, but in terms of ultra-moisturizing, yes, it gets the job done. It gets the job done really, really well. Um, yeah, I think the, I think the biggest factor in this is because it has a lot of extra virgin olive oil and a lot of avocado oil in it and I think that's what contributes to the moisturizing factor and it also has the signature shea butter but if you're going to use this body wash I highly recommend using it with like a a poof I guess that's what it's called one of those poof looking things so you can squeeze squeeze into a lather because if you try to use this with your bare hands you're not going to get much of a bubbly lather with this if you try to use it with a poof then the bubbles start to appear and you will bathe yourself in ridiculously moisturizing bubbles the smell is the fragrance is really pleasant it's a very clean yet floral kind of smell that's the only way i can describe it it's a very floral kind of smell yet when it washes off it's not powerful it's not like one of those powerful synthetic fragrances that you usually get in typical body washes it's just a fresh clean smell that that's left behind when you're rinsing it off it does not strip your skin ladies and gentlemen this is not the kind of body wash that will strip your skin and leave you dry to where you got a pile on the lotion no this stuff will not strip your skin at all. Although I do recommend you bathe in warm water. Do not bathe in scalding hot. But my ben the only way you can get best results using this is bathe in warm water and use one of those um, bathing poofs. Seriously, I cannot remember the name of those. But use one of those and you'll get a lot of bubbly lather that will get you nice and clean and leave you smelling fresh all day. So I really like this body wash and I can see myself using it again. Although I'm really going to drift back into bar soap. But if I ever want to go back to a body wash, this would be the one I would want to try. So I really like it. And like I said, you can find it at Target. And if you're lucky enough, find it at Walgreens and CVS Pharmacy. It's another product from the Shea Moisture line. And if you tried it before, please feel free to leave your comments below in the comment section. Let me know how it worked for you. And if you like my review, leave a thumbs up. Leave a thumbs up. Make sure you rate it. Just let me know how, what you think. Have you tried it? Did it work out for you? Let me know. Don't be afraid to tell me. And this is another review from me, and I'm signing off. I have more to come, so see ya.